what's up everyone this is pretty as hell and welcome back to resident evil 4 remake uh this video is like a second part for the previous video which i wanna talk again about these um weapon uh, upgrade tickets I got a lot of questions from you guys and you guys been wondering like you know if I used it on a certain weapon and uh, like will this weapon will you know be upgraded even if you played uh, for another walkthrough and stuff like that so I will try my best to answer all your questions and I will uh, tell you which trophies you can unlock with this uh, ads or the benefits that you know Capcom uh, just got in the store. Um, <clears throat> right now I'm playing New Game Plus because I got two tickets um, and I want to see if I played a new game plus well I have my tickets or do I need to start a new game so as you can see in here I got two tickets this is new game plus as you can see I got my RPG and I got my all the items that uh, and all my treasures and stuff <clears throat> so you can have the tickets right away as soon as you purchase them and play new game plus it will be in there even though I don't really recommend that you get a ticket for new game plus I mean the RPG is enough to be honest even on professional mode um I don't know uh, the Chicago is not bad, but I feel like it's not as good as the RPG. I don't know, that's my that's my opinion. I don't know, it takes a little bit of time for the enemies to die, even if you fully upgrade it, like the damage and stuff. So, the second question that I have people asking, like, if they died in the game, will they lose the tickets? Or they will be still having it so as you can see Leon is struggling right now <laughs> um, I'll let him die and then we will go check again with the merchant so yeah that's tragic <laughs> okay I'll click on continue and uh, We'll head to the merchant again. There is some things that I don't like about the tickets, and I will we'll talk about it in a few. Okay, we still got the tickets. As you can see on the top, it says two tickets. And as you can see at the bottom, he said you have a ticket. So, <laughs> yeah, you don't lose your ticket if you died and you have it in new game plus so let's try um, an old save data <clears throat> with playthrough one so this is new game this is not a new game plus but it's an old save data Okay, I just want to check in here, see if I have my tickets or not. Um, yeah, like I was saying, I don't like some stuff about the tickets. They are limited, so you guys have to be careful how to use them. Um, I'm sure you notice it says ticket A and ticket B and ticket C. I think until F, I'm not sure either E or F something like that if you used one in the game you cannot purchase it again <clears throat> like if you buy ticket A 
you cannot buy ticket A again if you used it in the game you have to buy ticket B and I will show you in a few exactly what I mean um, so the old save data with new game plus I still have the ticket <clears throat> on any you know like it doesn't matter what chapter I'm in I have it in there so that's pretty well so right now I will try a new game like freshly new game and uh, <clears throat> I will see uh, if I can carry it in there I'll play assisted because it's faster I don't want to take long <clears throat> so um, I know some of you guys don't like the idea of this thing you have an easy way without you know like get the infinite um, uh, Chicago weapon without buying any tickets but I'm just reviewing this one in here you know for some people they don't want to you know like farm and stuff and do some quests so they just want to earn the trophies and you know move on with it so that's why I'm showing it because some people are interested um yes on new game plus not pl plus I'm sorry a new game you do have the tickets uh, carried with you so the easy way to get the infinite uh, Chicago without buying no tickets from the store I want you to finish um, eight side quests the uh, the um, the first one on chapter two I think it's destroy the uh, uh, blue metals and then the viper hunt which you uh, get three snakes and then sell them to the merchant and after that is the gray robber which is uh, you destroy the two graves with the um, the uh, what do you call it the um, sign on it or something uh, and then you have the another blue metals and do the egg hunt which is on the lake and catch me a big fish which is on the lake as well <clears throat> and the last one is the savage mutt which you kill the uh, the werewolf or something like that when you do these uh, the last one in chapter 5 because on chapter 6 the merchant will offer you the first ticket so you will have enough maybe you will have like 32 33 um, the spinal gem with you so this is the easiest way to you know get uh, the infinite uh, Chicago without buying no tickets so I'm trying to you know <laughs> cheer the both sides I know some of you people don't like um, don't like to you know buy from the store and make it easier for you <clears throat> not easier but you know like you, you like some challenge and stuff but yeah um, I started a new game on hardcore in this walkthrough um, because as you can see it's on hardcore my Chicago is not infinite in here but I have another playthrough which is on hardcore as well this one in here and I did use a ticket in chapter 2 
to make my Chicago infinite as you can see in here this is what I hate if you use your ticket in a certain walkthrough it does not carry with you to the other walkthroughs you have to you know keep buying tickets for each playthrough that you want to play <clears throat> so for me I just want to get two tickets for this hardcore walkthrough and uh, I will go on professional and try it there because I'm aiming for S plus <clears throat> sorry um, so this is the thing that I don't like if you use that ticket in a certain walkthrough and you use it on your Chicago or your hand cannon you will not carry this upgraded weapon with you it's not going to be infinite if you play it on another walkthrough you have to play it on a certain walkthrough that you use the ticket uh, on that walkthrough so uh, this is a big no for me I don't like this it's gonna ask you like you know you want more you should buy more so but um yeah I mean uh, uh, there is good things about it and there is a bad things about it um, but um I mean, if you're aiming for the Platinum, it's going to help you a lot. But like I said earlier, be careful if you bought a ticket, which Capcom named them A, B, C, D, E, F, I guess. If you install, like uh, this one, I'm showing an example. I bought this one, I purchased it. By the way, if you buy one, they will give you for PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 they are named these are named tickets a b c and stuff like that <clears throat> so if you bought an a ticket and you used it you're not going to be able to rebuy it at the store you will have to go buy a b ticket or a c or a d and uh, <clears throat> so it shows you how limited they are so um for the trophies, what you can get, um, I want to show you in here, uh, there is like a crown icon in here, I'm sure you guys see it, if you beat the game, you're gonna unlock the professional and Leon, um, outfit, <coughs> sorry, uh, you can get, um, I totally recommend this one if you want to finish the, uh, uh, I forgot the name of the trophy, but you only use a knife and a handgun. So the other rewards, they are useless to be honest. <clears throat> this uh, finish the game on uh, normal or higher uh, with A rank and stuff, it's totally useless rewards. Um, <clears throat> the deer is not bad, but I didn't unlock it as you can see. Uh, complete the main story on hardcore or higher, all these rewards are useless. I mean, I don't know, but if you finish the main story on hardcore or higher, uh, A rank, you will unlock the armor for Ashley, which is totally recommended she's not gonna die <clears throat> so um the chicken head is good the gas mask it's good if you don't aim like you know you're shaky or something it will help you a lot so this one the hand cannon complete a new game in the main story on professional without using any bonus weapons Chicago is a bonus weapon so you cannot use it and uh, if you beat the game of professional uh, <clears throat> without using any bonus weapon you will get the hand cannon but like I said previously um, 
if you played the mercenaries and you completed all three stages and got an S rank with all the three stages you will unlock uh, the hand cannon uh, and you know it will be a lot easier so about the trophies um, yes you can unlock the trophies if you got the tickets either you know like normally in the game or you bought a ticket and you upgraded your uh, Chicago weapon or the hand cannon weapon uh, the S plus only requires you to be fast you know like speed running the uh, playthrough um, you have to start a new game not a new game plus just a new game as you can see in here it says playthrough one which is a new freshly game you know like you just started it um, for the assisted four hours or under four hours and for normal you have to beat the game in under five hours hardcore and professional under five hours and 30 minutes but for professional you only have 15 saves so you can't save the game 16 times or more it will not count uh, S plus for you so you gotta be careful with that um, if you um, use the Chicago and it's infinite that will make it a lot easier on you and if you got the hand cannon which is more powerful um, it will be much easier so <clears throat> uh, as you can see in here I only got S rank because I started new game plus on professional that's how I unlocked my Chicago weapon so next I'm aiming for the S plus um so yeah uh i hope i answered uh most of your questions guys uh like i said before it can come in handy but it's not something you know like necessary if i want to buy a ticket i only need like one or two and that's about it um but yeah uh I hope this video will help you and guide you. Um hopefully in the upcoming days I will upload a video about S rank and uh sorry S plus rank uh, and you know how to uh, do that easily and what to equip and you know stuff like that I'll make a guide for it and I'll try one of it with the ticket and the other one is without the ticket so I hope this video was helpful um, thanks everyone for the support uh, this was pretty as hell I'll see you in the next video and thanks for watching everyone.